Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpo Gaming and another Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom video. Today we have another cool guy for you. We're going after the last part of our set for the wild. The trousers of the wilds can be yours today and I'll show you how you can get them right here, right now. Let's go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. This is where we're going to start off our adventures at. All the way by the Elden Mountains. The Typhaloo Ruins Skyview Tower. We're going to make our way over into this chasm, into the depths, and then make our way all the way up to the top right hand part of the screen. Yep, there's a, quite a few of these light routes that we need to hit. So once you make your way into the chasm, make sure you orientate yourself towards the right hand side of the map so you can save yourself some time. Now, once you do that and you make your way into the depths, you're gonna be greeted by a huge mountain range. You can go to the right or you can go to the left, but there's a huge giant rock wall sitting in front of you. If you go to the right, you're kinda of gonna be out the way. So make sure you head to the left. Now, once you make your way to the left, well then you're gonna start seeing some of the map kinda of like highlight itself from the bottom and some of the enemies. Just keep making your way to the left. It's gonna be very dark if it's your very first time, but no worries, you're gonna be right up against walls and a whole bunch of the gloom. But you should be in a safe spot with no enemies around you. Now, if you come this direction, you'll see that next light route right in front of you, at least just a little bit of it, to kind of let you know that you're headed in the right direction. So from there, just keep making your way to the light route and light up that part of the map. You have the Cantium Light Rule. I'm probably solid in that, but it's cool. You made it to the Light Rule, and this is the next one on our way to get to where we need to go. And there is quite a few different enemies around here. If you see the Stone Talus, you're headed the right direction. The Lex Light Rule is right past the Stone Talus. The Kayam Light Rule. I'm hopefully not slaughtering that. All right, so from the Kayam Light Rule, we are then going to make our way to that lovely skeleton. Finally, it's highlighting. You can see where we need to go. So I'm going to go ahead and pin this marker right here. At the mouth of this skeleton will be what we are looking for. We have the Elden Dark Skeleton at the Elden Mountain Depths. Over here, there are quite a few enemies, but you can kind of avoid them. And there are some of those gloom hands that come out when Phantom Ganon is around. So if you don't move fast enough, they will swarm you and grab you. So just make sure you run over here, use the sin, and head over from the top. Otherwise, those hands will be waiting down on you at the bottom, okay? Also, there's a lot of heat. Make sure you have some heat resistant clothes on. And just like that, you have now have the trousers of the wild. Let's just add that these pants was tailored for a hero that travels the world and strangely, they are the most comfortable pair of pants that you want. That's because they're yours and you have them, my dude. Congratulations. But for right now, that's pretty much going to for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. As always, if you are new to the channel, how you doing and welcome. And don't forget to subscribe because right here at Carpool Game, a little wide variety of videos range from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.